Make a cutscene in one minute? Fake? <sighs> it's been a while since I said that, but let me show you. First, make your set. I'm going to use the old Roblox tower. Once you have your super sexy set down, open up Codes Otaku Cutscene Editor. Look, I know you. some of you guys have a bad history with this. Look, trust me, okay? Give it a super crazy awesome name and then hit Create or Select Cutscene. For the first position, set the duration to zero and then hit space or capture a camera position. Then set the duration to whatever you want and capture as many positions as you want. Once you have your scene, hit generate script. Get rid of all of this and close the editor and if your mouse gets stuck, go to home and click on move or select. This is the most important step. Move the script from starter player scripts to starter character scripts or the script will not work. Put a part down and set play on character added to false. Go to cutscene, open skip cutscene and set visible to false. Now go to play on part touch, click on value and set the value to the part you just placed down. Also go to music and delete what's in the sound ID. You can change the name of the script to whatever you want. Now just play it and search the part and oh my god! It's true what the title says. That's it for me everybody. This is the video that made my channel take off two years ago, so I thought, what better way to end than the way I started. Over the last few years, I've been seen by almost one million people, and we've had some good moments. What the hell? Now go ahead and test it. What the hell? We had a lot of good moments, so thank you, everybody, for all the cool moments. But it's time to close the door. To the tutorials, at least. <laughs> Look, y'all, I'm not done yet. My videos are not over. I'm still uploading. Don't worry. But my tutorials are probably done for now. Actually, not probably. They're definitely done for now. But it's okay. I'll still help you if you join my Discord server. It's pretty active, and there's always people willing to help you, including me. And I'll still be making studio content. I'm really active in streams, so you'll definitely be catching me soon. So for now, goodbye to the tutorial videos, and we're going to be trying out new things this year. Can't wait to see what this year comes up with. Let's do it!